Hello guys, Habibi here. I have this game in Apple App Store. I had it several years ago, but it has ads in it, advertising. And now I want to remove the ads and update the app. I've uploaded the new version of the app without advertising and in the review process they rejected the app why and the reason is this they said I have the privacy problem they said uh, you can see, you can see their message about legal privacy data use and sharing To resolve the issue, I can do one of these two. If you do not currently track or decide or to stop tracking, update your app privacy information in App Store Connect. Or if you track users, you must implement app tracking transparency and blah blah blah. So, because I'm not tracking any user information or device information because I'm not using AdMob SDK anymore because I'm not showing ads anymore it means I am not track I'm not tracking I'm not tracking any information of users so they said I need to update the app privacy information so I did it here but it doesn't work in this new version I go to app privacy previously I was tracking uh, device ID and now because in this new version of the app I do not track anything so they said I need to edit this app privacy information but it doesn't work let me show you I click this edit and then I choose no we do not collect data from this app I cannot choose this option and this message appears your app contains an as user tracking usage description indicating that you will request permission to track users I don't understand why this message appears because my new version of app doesn't have anything uh, about this NS user tracking user dis description because the app is uh, doesn't have any ads SDK in it and I cannot choose this one after reading some forums they said yeah they said about this thing and here So I think now I just I will pretend as I am tracking user data while I'm not tracking any data so I will choose this one if you track users you must implement app tracking transparency and request permission before collecting data so I will try this one because this option I cannot uh, go with this option you know because of that problem so I will try to implement app tracking transparency and let me check this link
what I will do is to add this NS user tracking usage description on my property list in Xcode and then I will re-upload the app to the app store and expect they will approve the app I know it is silly because my new app doesn't track anything and I need to go with this option okay here is my project in Xcode I will go to property list here it is and then I will add this according to this page select your projects info dot p list in the in Xcode project navigator modify the file using its property later. privacy tracking is tracking usage description so I will add privacy tracking usage description and how to add it maybe I can add it like this I type privacy doesn't show anything I know it's a bit annoying so let, let me find B L M N O P Ah this one Privacy There are so much privacy options here in this one, this one. Tracking usage description. Okay. And then I will set the value. What should I say? What should I say? Maybe I will type this app does not anything about you but <coughs> okay let me let me just type something like this this app doesn't does not track anything about you just click yes or no because this question does not mean anything. Any ah, any anything. Have a nice day. Okay, it is just work around and let me see. Can I re-upload the, the game or not? And I hope they will approve this one because it has tracking usage description now in my P list because they said I need that one. You must implement a tracking transparency. 
Hmm. And they also sit here. They need to receive the user's permission to the abstracting transparency framework. I don't know. Uh, later I will try to replay the reviewer message here uh, I can not set the option to I do not track but I will try the same to add uh, to add in my apps playlist file but I'm not is it what you Okay guys, I will re resubmit. I will resubmit my app and this video in YouTube. I will put my link of this video here so the review team of Apple can watch the video and see what is my problem. And yeah, I will upload this app and later whether they approve or disapprove the app i will let you know in the description of this video and yeah that's all for this video if you experience the same thing like this and you know what is the solution maybe you can share with us let me know in the comment uh, in the comment section below okay bye bye see you next time